Lately, it seems that every major brand that produces and manufactures cameras and accessories want to get a piece of the pie from the microphone market. And this is no different. One of the latest, the Mirfak brand. Yes, the microphone brand from Oza. So, today's review, Mirfak Audio wireless microphone system called the VE-10. This is the single receiver with the transmitter. There is also a pro version where you get two transmitters. So let's get straight to the unboxing and see what you get inside the box. In the box you will find the transmitter and the receiver, 3.5mm camera cable, 3.5mm smartphone cable, USB-C charging cable, lavalier mic, big wind muff attachment for the actual transmitter, holding pouch and a small manual. Let's have a look into the buttons and layout of the actual product. The transmitter has a microphone on top. Yes, you can use it as a ready device to record and you don't have to connect to any dedicated lavalier mic. Just record straight out from the transmitter. This will be great for really fast running gun setups, making your recording easier and simple. There is also the belt pouch shoe clip on both the receiver and the transmitter. Power mode button on the right with three LED lights and the lavalier microphone input. On the other side there are some more interesting things. This is actually not just a microphone transmitter, but a fully fledged backup recorder. Backup recording option up to an card of 64 GB. USB-C charging port. Let's get straight on the receiver. In the front there is a bright green, bluish OLED screen with all the basic info. Connection status, battery level, audio gain level, low cut filter, status, and level of decibels. On the left side there is a headphone monitoring jack and the line out for your camera with a dedicated power button. On the right side there are decibel adjustments and mute control or you can switch between the low cut filter 0Hz, 170Hz and 230Hz. Basically a standard package for one person recording. The stated range is up to 30 meters, so this system is really designed to have your subject of recording closer to your camera or device. There is no point of testing it through the walls, cause this system is really intended to have an interviewed person in front of you or anything that's in front of you and not distant and far away. So it's kind of a recording on point, on site and actually the 30 meters distance is kind of enough. One thing that I noticed with the backup recording on the transmitter is that no matter what settings I used on the receiver, the backup recording was always at the same level. There is no setting that I found either on the tech spec side or actually on the manual to change the volume of the recording, the actual backup recording. So you have to understand that your backup recording might clip and actually get some clip spikes on your recording. The batteries out of and full charge will last you around 5 hours of usage more than enough for a system like this. And they can be also charged and powered while in use via USB-C. This system is priced a little lower than the competitors and it has a built-in backup recording that's a bit dubious. Don't get me wrong, if you don't need more than 30 meters and you get kind of a backup recording, this is actually a good option to go. Comment section down below if you have any questions and until my next one, Thumbs up if you liked it, subscribe with the bearing icon to get notified every time I make a new video and see you on my next one.